Brooklyn Independent Television. Shirley Chisholm's legacy is alive and well in a new middle school in Brownsville that's helping to close the learning gap, especially when it comes to math, science, and technology. Ginny Pase Rodriguez is with the driving force behind Mott Hall Bridges Academy. We are the Mott Hall Bridges Scholars. We pledge to respect ourselves, our kids, and the adults in our community. Practice kindness to those around us. Show enthusiasm for the opportunities ahead of us. Strive towards exemplary achievement in all that we do. Practice good citizenship and work hard to be the best scholar I can be. Jasmine is one of 56th graders in the inaugural class of the recently opened Mott Hall Bridges Academy in Brownsville. In the respective honor of breaking ground and transformation in Brownsville, right, right, yes. right, right, I cut this ribbon. this small public school, we provide outstanding education and we want to provide a world-class learning environment for each and every one of our students. So we take any student who comes in here, no matter what level they are, and our focus is to create goals to let students get to the level that they need to be on or above grade level. What Mott Hall Bridges Academy is offering, it's offering a small learning environment that you might perhaps catch in a charter school, but it's still a public school. So we're really honestly just giving um, the community another option. With a focus on math, science, and technology, the middle school follows the curriculum originally established at the Mott Hall School, founded in Harlem in 1985. During the middle school ages, it's an opportunity for us to allow students to engage in project-based learning, allow them to engage in democratic classrooms where their voice is very important, and they get to ask the questions of why and understand the process of getting to the answer as opposed to just being given the answer. We've been learning angles, like acute, obtuse, and the science teacher been teaching us about the ecosystem and about cardiology, oh, yeah. meteorology, about the cardiology. Geology. I know, Those are I things know, that we I work know. together as a, as, a, as a group, as a family with, because the homework is even challenging once you've been out of school for so long. When he brings his homework, I'm happy because I know that I'm being challenged again. And you know what, I see the progression from last year. I really do. In such a short amount of time, I'm very, very happy. When students like Justin walk the hallways, it's not only their hard work that's displayed, but also carefully chosen words to live by. The reason why we have quotes throughout the building is because I really believe that words breathe life. And what you see, you become, and how you act is how you present yourself. It's all about your words, and sometimes not even words that are spoken. But I live by quotes, and I want my kids to know that I really took the time to choose each and every one of the words that you see here so that they know that it's important education is just not in books. It's all around you, and what you read, you should actually breathe. We use the word scholars at Mott Hall Bridges Academy because anyone could be a student, but not everyone reaches that title of scholar. And a scholar is someone that always strives for excellence in all that they do. And that extends beyond the classroom. Our students are required to do 75 hours of community service before they graduate because we feel like it's key to make them very, um, a, a very good competitive student when they're selecting high schools. We really look at um, high school articulation in the early years so our students actually visit other high schools and learn about the different professions um, and then they get training or what we say prep for the specialized high school test at an early time and in addition to that we're a, a community-based school so we not only look at the student as the learner but parents and all of the staff as well so Mount Hall Bridges the, um, the idea behind it is connecting past present to future and also connecting everyone the stakeholders which is the parents the students the staff the community together and creating this connection for the success of all of our children. For now, only sixth graders are enrolled in Mott Hall Bridges Academy. The school will open its doors to seventh and eighth graders in the next two years. For Brooklyn Review, I'm Jenny Passe Rodriguez. Follow us on Twitter at BK Independent TV.